please rise. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Geneva. I'm Caitlin Kinahan. And I'm Megan Fee. So we hope you had an awesome weekend, a great snow day, ton of fun at Winter Formal. It was a packed weekend. But on today's show, even though all that fun is over, we'll highlight some what's going on this week. And we have two exclusive on-set interviews with all the info. And although I'm literally exhausted after the long weekend, I'm super excited because on today's show, we're going to show you how you can win this awesome 3D printed <laughs> golden Vikings helmet. <laughs> so stay tuned, Geneva, because GTV News starts right now. <laughs> Welcome back to Neva. Here are your morning announcements for Monday, February 12th, 2018. And we are going to dive right into the show today because it is a special month. It's CTE month, which stands for Career and Technical Education. That's right. For all of you in business classes or that have an interest in pursuing a career in any type of business field, you should be sure to hear what this month is all about. GTV reporter Carly Rasmussen is in studio with a few students who have all the info. Carly? Thanks, guys. I'm here with three members of the CTE club here at GHS, Kyle O'Malley, Brianna Baker, and Johnny Verba. So, guys, what is CTE? CTE stands for Career and Technical Education. So, basically, classes that Geneva provides, such as the business classes, tech ed, and facts, that prepare you for your future and career options. Very cool. And what is CTE Week? So CTE Week, we have some events going on. As you can see, you guys have passed the uh, tables in the commons. Basically, you can come down there and sign your name, get a free lanyard and pencil. And basically, what that is, is countless times I hear people saying, you know, when am I going to learn this information or use it in the real world? Well, that's what CTE Week is all about, using that information in the real world in these types of classes like business, consumer, and technology education. So come down and have your voice heard. And um, how are you guys involved in CTE? All three of us are involved in the Virtual Enterprises International class. Um, it's basically a class where we create our own firm and we go into this huge virtual economy and uh, you know, we can trade with other firms and you know, we, we make business deals and everything. Um, it's a great experience because you know, we're able to gain a lot of on-hand information, um, not only in the business world but you know, in, in other life lessons as well. Very cool. And what is this uh, awesome trophy you guys got here? This fantastic trophy is actually 3D printed and has been crafted by our technology uh, department here at GHS. And basically, you can win this. Your second hour class will be having a competition with all other second hour classes this week. And on Friday, the winners will be announced. All you have to do is bring in simple medical supplies, such as Band-Aids and or movies or something that a kid diagnosed with cancer or life-threatening disease would want. Um, you don't want a kid looking at a boring pink Band-Aid, so bring something fun, Batman, Superman, something to make the kids day. And your class can win this fantastic trophy, as well as freshly baked chocolate chip cookies from our technology, sorry, consumer education department. Well, it sounds like a great way to get involved. Be sure to head on down to the comments to see what CTE is all about. Thanks, guys. Back to the desk. Thanks, Carly. CTE week sounds super, super fun. I, see, I saw the tables in the comments today. So be sure to stop by if you need some more information. Yeah, this is definitely a great way to take advantage of all the awesome opportunities right here at GHS. And remember, Mrs. Warren, the career counselor, is always available to help you plan your career. So stop by and see her as well. Yes, for sure. And now we've got GTV reporter Carly Rasmussen back in studio with a member of FCA. Carly, take it away. Thanks, guys. I'm here today with a member of FCA, Ava Pignataro. So, Ava, what is FCA? So, FCA is Fellowship of Christian Athletes. Um, and what do you guys do? So we eat snacks and we play games and we talk about God and we just have a good time. Sounds really fun. Uh, when are your meetings? Um, KK270 at 6.35 a.m. on Tuesdays. Very cool. So if you guys are interested in FCA, be sure to head on down to their meeting tomorrow morning. Thanks, Ava. Back to the desk. Thanks, girls. Be sure to check out FCA if you're interested. Attention all wrestlers, equipment check-in will be tomorrow after school, so make sure you have your singlet and any other materials ready to be returned. Any sophomores or juniors interested in applying to the National English Honor Society? Applications are available in the main office 
KK268, and in English 2 and 3 classes. See Mrs. Ludke if you have any questions. And if you're still looking to embrace all the snow, well, the registration for the final Alpine Club, club trip of the season has been extended to tomorrow at 3 o'clock. Forms can be picked up in room H204 and returned there as well. Next week is International Week, so in preparation, every day this week we'll be ha we will be having one fun fact. Did you know that medical studies have found that speaking two or more languages is a great asset to the cognitive process? Brains actually operate differently when knowing more than one language, and these differences shape your mentality. And now here's three to know before we go. Social Studies National Honor Society apps are due on Friday. Mark your calendars for the job fair coming up next Monday. And be sure to make it out tonight to the contest gym for the boys' basketball varsity game. They're playing North again. It should be an awesome game. The last time they played, it was unreal. So make it out to the Blue Crew and hopefully cheer them on to another win. Yes, it's going to be a lot of fun. And that is all the news that we have for you today. I'm Caitlin Keenahan. And I'm Megan Fee. Have a marvelous Monday, Geneva, and go Vikings.